Hi, my name is Farz Azad and I'm presenting to you the introduction of sieving analysis. As you can see in this slide, sieving analysis is a common method used to determine the particle size of distribution of a sample size of granular material, such as soil, sand, or powder. The experiment involved passing the sample through a series of sieves with progressively smaller mesh size and measuring the mass of material that passes through each sieve. The resulting data provides information about the particle size distribution and can be used to evaluate the quality of a sample or to determine the suitability of a material for a particular application. As for the experiment, the objective is to determine the grain size distribution of soil to identify if the total mass from the beginning will also be the total mass after the experiment, to determine the percent of retained soil in each sieve and to compute the percent thinner in each opening. So we weight the sample uh, with its pen and then we put in the table and from the table we can conclude the we can calculate the weight of sample retained and percentage re retained and cumulative percent retained uh, percentage thinner. For the percentage retained, uh, the sum up of the total uh, will be 100% and then also the cumulative percent retained is also total 100%. So from this table, we can analyze it by doing a graph. A graph is a percent finer by weight against particle size that can be obtained from the result we get from the experiment. It was presented by semi logarithmic plots known as particle size distribution curve and in the same graph there were information we can get like diameter then which is percent of the particles are finer than the size of sand d30 is 30 percent of the particles are finer than the size of sand and last is t60 is a 60 percent of particles that are finer than the size of sand so for the discussion uh, we get the diameter uh, D10, D30 and D60. We get that D, uh, <coughs> which is 10% particles finer than sand, 30% particles finer than the particle sand, 60% uh, particles that are finer than sand, respectively. So, based on the formula below, uh, coefficient of uniformity d60 over d10 and coefficient of curvature d30 square over d60 times d10 we get the value of coefficient of uniformity cu is 1.78 and coefficient of curvature is 0 0.975 so the value of cu is less than 6 indicates that the particle size gradient is poorly graded Application of sieving analysis to petroleum engineering is to determine the soil's permeability. The soil's permeability is used to estimate soil water movement. The next application is sand control well. It is used to prevent sand or small particles to enter the well. And the final application of sieving analysis to petroleum engineering is to determining is to determine bridging material for drill-in and compression fluid that are used to remove drill cutting and maintain stability during drilling.